Kip K's Video Tips and Tricks, Volume 1. Number 1. Give your camera a wedgie. Here's a great way to prop up your camcorder when you don't have a tripod and you want a low angle shot from the ground. A regular rubber doorstop works perfect. You can move the wedge design up and back to set the shot higher or lower. And because it's made of rubber, it stays put. Number 2. Here's a cheap way to get a soft look effect without expensive filters. All you need is a regular set of pantyhose. Cut out a small square with a pair of scissors and apply it over the lens using a rubber band. By adjusting how tight it is, you can change the intensity of the softness. Number 3. Sometimes you have to run cables across a doorway or where people will walk and you don't want people tripping, so you have to tape it down. And you don't want to use duct tape. That leaves a nasty residue. Regular gaffer's tape can be pretty expensive, but an alternative is to pick up a roll of Scotch Blue Painter's Tape. You can find it at your home improvement store. It's easy to apply and remove, and its bright color makes it very visible. Number 4. Unless you have a professional tripod, it's hard to tell if your camera is level. I found a small bubble level for under 2 bucks. Use some double-sided tape, stick it to your tripod, then you'll know when your camera is level all the time. And number five. Here's a compact, easy to use replacement for a tripod in a pinch. I found an eye bolt that matched the threads of my camcorder. Then tying about a five foot length of black bungee cord to the eye bolt, I made a convenient camera stabilizer. By stepping on the cord and pulling it tight while shooting, it steadies the camera pretty well. It's easy, portable, and works great. Kip K's Video Tips and Tricks, Volume 1.